In this video, I'll show you how to properly install and set up your new Nightstick TCM 550XL GL weapon light with green laser. Before I get started, a quick word about safety. Please be sure to read, understand, and follow all of the safety instructions for your handgun. And always double check to make sure that your firearm is in a safe and unloaded condition before doing any kind of work on it. As you can see, I have no ammunition in the chamber. There's no magazine or ammunition anywhere around. To install the battery, unscrew the bezel on the light and insert the included battery positive in first. Then, reinstall the bezel. Let me take a second to point out a very special feature on the TCM, the battery safe mode. If you look on the side of the light near the bezel, you'll see a double-headed arrow with the words off and on. You'll also notice a dot laser etched into the bezel ring. When the dot lines up with the word off, the light will not activate. This is battery safe mode. In this mode, the TCM and handgun can be safely transported outside of its holster without any concern of the light coming on by accident. When you want the light to operate, simply turn the bezel ring until it stops and the dot lines up with the word on to take the TCM out of battery safe mode and reactivate the switches. Your new TCM 550XL GL comes pre-installed with the C1 modular rail insert. This configuration is perfect for approximately 70% of the handguns on the market. If, however, this setup doesn't fit your handgun correctly, use the included Allen wrench and one of the other included inserts to configure the fit that works best for your specific firearm. There's a modular insert reference guide on the Nightstick website if you should need it. Next, with the cross tension screw fully loosened, push in on the screw head and rotate the light onto the rail of your gun, making sure that the insert is fully seated in the slot on your handgun. The final step is to tighten the light onto the gun. While holding the light firmly onto the rail of the gun, begin tightening the cross tension screw. The easiest way is to use a coin. A dime or a penny work equally well. Once it's snug, give it a little extra turn just to make sure it's fully secure. It's important that this be basically as tight as you can make it. That's it. You're ready to go. Just be sure to periodically check the insert and the cross tension screw for tightness. Your new TCM 550 XL GL has ambidextrous switches. They both work exactly the same. A quick press and release of either switch puts the TCM into constant on mode. Press and release again and the TCM turns off. For momentary operation, press and hold either switch. When you release the switch, the TCM turns off. The TCM 550XL GL provides you with your choice of white light only, green laser only, or white light with green laser. Switching between the modes can be done at any time. All you have to do is press and hold the switch on either side of the light and then repeatedly press the other. When you're happy with the lighting mode, simply release both switches. The TCM will remember the mode each time you activate the light until you turn the battery safe mode on change the battery, or change the setting yourself. The objective with the TCM is to have the laser match your bullet's point of impact. First, put the TCM into green laser mode and then decide at what distance you want the laser and the bullet to intersect. This will be your zero. This can basically be any distance you want, but generally speaking, because of the offset between the laser and the handgun's bore, there will only be one point where the two intersect exactly. Once you've picked your distance, get a good sight picture using the handgun's iron sights, and then use the included Allen wrench to adjust the laser using the windage and elevation adjusters located on the side and bottom of the light. What you want is to get the laser dot to be centered on top of the front sight post when aiming normally. Once that's done, it's time to head out to the range to refine the adjustments. Setting up at the same distance you used previously, carefully shoot a three to five round grouping with the laser aimed at the exact center of your target. Next, make note of where your shot grouping is. In my example, all of the points of impact are high and to the right of my point of aim. 
That means I need to turn the wind adjustment in the left direction on the side of the light and turn the elevation adjustment on the bottom of the light in the down direction. Then shoot another grouping and continue to refine the adjustments until you're satisfied that your point of impact matches your point of aim with the laser. Keep in mind, you may need to re-zero if you switch to a different type of ammo. For example, your range ammo versus your defensive loads. Congratulations! Your new Nightstick TCM 550XL GL weapon mounted light is ready to go. If you have any questions or if we can be of any assistance, please contact our customer service department by calling 800-233-2155. Thanks for joining me. We'll see you next time.